<laughs> this ugly stick reel's all beaten up. That's not too bad of a fish. Yeah. I have to use this ugly stick tonight because my nightstick's all um, broken. The reel fell apart at the river the other day. And now I'm up here at the lake tonight. That's awesome. What is it? A good sized bullhead? Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh, wow. Monster bullhead. That's awesome. Yeah, I'd rather not use this ugly stick reel tonight, but I'm going to have to deal with it. But I got this guy in a nightcrawler. I'm just setting up some bait poles here. I just had this first pole set up. I didn't even set up the other two yet, and I already got this guy. That's beautiful. It's solid 16 plus. Let's measure him here. Under the white light for you. Oh. <laughs> there we go. I wasn't even ready for this. I gotta find a good spot. Mm-hmm. Dead on 16. That's a nice bullhead. I've caught a lot of them this size, though. A um, uh, quick story. Back in the day, I used to fish for record bullhead. I'd go through a lot of really agonizing things. Um, I'd get super sick and, like, hypothermic almost because all the mist would pour on me and it'd be 40-some degrees all night. And I would do that night after night after night and it'd be terrible, but I caught tons of 15, 16-inch bullhead and I was trying you know, to get one in the low 20s to break the record, but one night I got 117, and that's the best I ever did. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. Wow, heavy fish. Well, decently heavy at least. You know, not expecting a catfish, so I mean, heavy for a bullhead. Uh, mm hmm. Wow. Another beauty. That's another 15, 16. them unhooked there there this is quite the process just measure them and release them and get the white light on them for you so you can actually see them I'm guessing this guy's 15 or 15 and a half I swapped out tape measures, but I picked out the wrong one. I'll just have to subtract. Oh, he's bleeding a little.
59 to 74. That makes him 15. Cool. Beauty. That was quite the hit. Not a massive fish like it sounded like, but definitely a, a fish. It, it peeled the drag. I don't know if you could hear it, but I was going for the other pole because it was getting taps too. Finally got all three set up. I was getting so many hits it took a while. This pole just has four pound test on it, but I don't have many options right now. Since my nightstick reel broke last night. Another bullhead. Feisty one. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, man. Look at that guy. Another fat 16 at least. Maybe a hair over. Solid 16, though. Wow, that's awesome. They're all, two out of three of them are hooked perfect too. Just right on the edge of the lip there. That one was getting hits too. But I had to run over and get this one because the drag was peeling out. Oh. Huh? All right. Finally got the right tape measure here. It's definitely one of the nicer bullheads I've ever caught. I think it's 16 and a half. Let's double check here. No, I think it's just a 16 or just a hair over, like less than a tenth over a 16. Somewhere right around there, but he's solid 16. I'm just measuring him wrong for a second at first, but that's a great bullhead. Hear him there? There's his head. And that's how thick he is. Beautiful fish. Yeah. This is the pole that I left while I was catching that other one. It looks like it has a little one on it. Oh, well, might be little. I don't know. Not the same size as the two bigger ones, but it might be a 15, solid 15 inch bullhead, not quite as fat though. Beauty. Wow. Ow. Hook there, measure him. Just quickly. Mm-hmm. Dead on fifteen. Two so far, they're dead on 15, and two, they're just about dead on 16. Or right around there, maybe a tiniest bit over, but another nice one. Yeah, I didn't notice it, but I definitely have a fish on this one. A smaller one.
Oh, cool. It's a beautiful little white sucker. I'm just trying to hurry here because there's storms coming. It's that, you know, the flash flood, the storms aren't over. That flash flood I mentioned. So I'm just trying to pack up. Maybe I'll continue fishing. I don't know how long they're going to last for. Hmm. Yeah, smaller sucker, 17 inches. And some subtle taps here. Kind of halfway packed up because of that storm. This is about all I have left out. I don't know if that's the wind or not. It might be. Usually like circular rod movement means the wind and I mean usually, not always, but and harder taps. It's a fish. Erratic taps. Non-rhythmic. Uh-huh. That's a fish. Just have to wait for him to get the whole night crawling in his mouth. Yeah, that storm's coming right up on me. Better hurry up here. Come on, fish. Hit it again. Might be a sucker. Because they kind of take their time and just slowly slurp it in. And if they miss, they'll like make another hit in like half a minute. Or it could just be a tiny bullhead. I don't know. <laughs> wow. Did I call that or what? It's like a four or five inch bullhead. <laughs> I don't think I've ever caught one that small. That's really good catfish bait right there. <laughs> Let's measure him for fun. A little longer than I thought, six and a half. What a trophy. <laughs> Beautiful little brown bullhead. That's a fish. Basically what happened was, um, uh, there's a that rainstorm came through and I accidentally fell asleep in the car, so now it's almost sunrise. Yeah, it's like a more normal sized bullhead, ten inch or so, or around there. Ten and a quarter. It's a real small 10 or so inch bullhead. Caught him by the whisker. Oh, well. No, I got him by the lip, but it just looked like the whisker. But, yeah, he's a small guy.
Okay. Yep, another 10. Feels like a better fish. I don't know if you still need the flashlight. Kind of seems right on the edge of daylight here. Oh, take and drag. Mm. Another big bullhead. That's a beauty. Mm. All right. Dead on 15. There we go. That feels like a decent fish. I know there's some snags down there, so I have to be careful. Oh wow, what is it, a sucker? Looks pretty good size. Jeez, it's pretty big. <laughs> I didn't expect that, he was just playing with it. That is a sucker, that could be a really big one. Don't get in the snags, please. Gotta lift him up in the water column here. Or she takes like the, the pole with like the worst rig and the lightest test. What is that? It looks like a carp with red fins. What the heck? That is strange. Now I need to know what it is. Oh, is it a carp? Can't even tell. Might be. Can't really get a good look at his face. Look at all this trash that came in with the flash flood. It's kind of fun on an ultralight. Just gotta be careful with him. He's getting more and more aggressive. I don't know if that's a carp. I'm not sure. It looks kind of strange. No, oh, I think it is actually. It's just a small one. I just saw his face. Weird. He really didn't hit it very hard to, to begin with. sure what to do here. Maybe take them under this pole and land them over here. And the mosquitoes this morning are ridiculous. Yep, small carp. See if we can lift him here. Just don't feel like getting down there. That doesn't seem worth it. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> that was kind of a fail. There we go. Got him.
Another bullhead, maybe. Awesome. Pretty good one. Not bad. Yeah, probably around 15. Measure them, then let them go. A little over 14, 14 and a quarter, or right around there. Yep, got a hook up. Is there a walleye? Tighten down the drag a little. It's kind of annoying. It looks like a small walleye. Or, I don't know, maybe not small, but not big. You know, 15, 16 ish, maybe. Hard to tell. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, it's definitely a 16 or so inch walleye. That seems like a bite right there too. Yeah, at least 16 I'd say, maybe. Yeah, somewhere right around there. Let's see what's on this pole. Yeah, that's a fish too, awesome. Double walleye suddenly. Weird. Real feisty too. It's awesome. Yeah, right around the same length as the other one. Just double check, see if I'm eyeballing them right. Seems at least 16 to me. There we go. Yeah, 16 three quarters. Yeah, I had a feeling the other one was probably at least 16 and a half. Cool. Oh, neat. That's something different. Big rock bass? Wow. That's awesome. That's definitely over 10 inches. That's a beauty. Oh, exactly 10. Okay. I'll take that. That's a great rock bass. Getting a hit on my half broken ugly stick. Getting a hit over there too, shoot. That's a fish. Man, that's annoying. The gears are like sliding or something. Oh, walleye. Walleyes are hitting. It's not a bad one. It's probably a 17. I will leave you right here for a minute. Just wait there while I get this one. Another walleye. A little smaller. Wow, getting hit over there now. 
That's funny. That's like 15, 15 and a half. All right. Oops. I noticed you fell off the hook. All right. You go back in. You can still wait right there. And I'll go catch this guy. Yep. That's three fish at once. Yeah. I think I should invest in some new poles. Oh, that's a big old sucker. Neat. I want the hook to pop, so I gotta try and take them up gently. That's not a bad sucker. It's better than the last one. 18 inches or so, right around there. Beauty. I keep hitting in pairs. Well, I'm almost out of bait, so I'm not gonna be here too much longer. I'd love to stay here all day though, but I have work and school and all those fun things. So, yeah, walleyes are hitting though, consistently. And then doubles too, it's like, I'll wait here 10 minutes, get nothing, and then both rods will go off at once, three times in a row. Yep, not bad walleyes, that one was like 17 and a quarter, I said it was 17. This one's probably around the same size as that one, 17. That pole's going off now. Around 17 probably. Yeah, 17 and a third. Awesome. That pole's really going off. Let this guy go. Get whatever this is. I think I have like one night crawler left plus some scraps. So I might hit up like the pillars with jigs or something and then get out of here. Another walleye. Awesome. Yeah, beauties. Right around the same size, 17 or so. Yep, dead on 17. Awesome. Yep. Waiting for another double. Well, this is it for the bait. Don't have any more. I'd love to run leeches in this kind of um, this kind of high murky water, but I don't have any, unfortunately. Another decent walleye, 15, 16. Awesome. <laughs> 